The Mbom 8, Africa's premier 8x8 armored vehicle, is changing the game in the world of modern armored warfare. Designed and manufactured in South Africa, this state-of-the-art infantry fighting vehicle, IFV, showcases the best of African innovation. Today, we dive into what makes the Mbom 8 one of the most formidable IFVs on the battlefield and why it's become a top choice for defense forces around the world. South Africa has a long history of military vehicle development, and the Mbom 8 is the latest in a line of combat-proven platforms. The idea behind the Mbom series was to create a highly mobile, mine-resistant armored vehicle that could operate in the toughest environments while offering unmatched protection. In a world where threats evolve quickly, the Mbom 8 was made to provide maximum protection against landmines, IEDs, and ballistic threats, while ensuring flexibility on the battlefield. Developed by South African defense company Paramount Group, the Mbom 8 is the third in the Mbom series, following the Mbom 4 and Mbom 6. Its design was focused on modularity and advanced protection. Engineers used a flat floor hull design to lower the vehicle's profile and minimize its center of gravity, providing superior stability. The vehicle's monocoque hull structure is made of armored steel, which provides multi-directional protection while maintaining a light weight. The Mbom 8 weighs approximately 28 tons. It is 8 meters long, 2.7 meters wide, and 2.4 meters high. It's armed with a range of weaponry, including a 30 millimeters automatic cannon or a heavy machine gun, depending on the configuration. The vehicle boasts a maximum road speed of 110 kilometers per hour and has a range of 800 kilometers on a single tank of fuel, making it an efficient yet highly mobile armored solution. The Mbom 8's strength lies in its versatility. It can be equipped with a wide variety of weapon systems, from machine guns to guided missiles. It also has one of the highest levels of protection for any IFV in the world, being able to withstand explosions equivalent to 10 kilograms of TNT under the hull. The flat hull design offers a unique blend of mine protection and vehicle stability, which is critical in modern conflict zones. One unique aspect of the Mbom 8 is its modularity. The vehicle can be configured for different combat roles, from an infantry fighting vehicle to an armored personnel carrier, reconnaissance vehicle, or even a command post. This makes it a multipurpose platform that can easily adapt to the needs of the battlefield, reducing logistical burdens. The Mbom 8 is designed to carry a crew of three, a commander, driver, and gunner. In addition, it has space to transport eight fully equipped infantry soldiers, providing them with safe and secure transportation into battle. The Mbom 8 has seen use by a number of countries in Africa, the Middle East, and beyond, with the vehicle operating effectively in desert, urban, and mountainous terrains. The feedback from these operational environments has been overwhelmingly positive, with military personnel praising its ruggedness, firepower, and survivability. While the Mbom 8 has many strengths, one downside is its relatively high cost compared to some other IFVs. Additionally, its heavier weight can limit some of its off-road capabilities in comparison to lighter vehicles. However, these drawbacks are generally outweighed by its superior protection and firepower. The Paramount Group has already addressed some of these concerns by offering different configurations of the Mbom series to meet various operational requirements. By offering different levels of armor and firepower, customers can balance protection, cost, and mobility to suit their needs. This approach ensures that even as warfare changes, the Mbom 8 can remain a relevant platform. The Mbom 8 represents the best of African engineering and innovation. With its robust design, advanced protection systems, and adaptability to different combat roles, it's no surprise that it's gaining attention around the world. Could this African powerhouse become the next go-to IFV for global defense forces? Let us know what you think in the comments below. If you enjoyed this video, please like, comment, and subscribe for more dives into military technology and history. Thanks for watching and we'll see you next time.